Welcome back to this mini series on minerals and the proper human diet. I'm John, your carnivore teacher, and today we're shining a light on a mineral that often gets overlooked until it's missing, iodine. Without it, the thyroid gland can't do its job. And when the thyroid slows down, the entire body slows down. From your energy and metabolism to brain function and even fertility, iodine is a quiet but crucial piece of the human nutrition puzzle. So why does iodine matter? Iodine's primary role is in the production of thyroid hormones, T4 and T3. These hormones regulate your metabolic rate, your body temperature, how efficiently you burn fuel, and even the development of your brain and nervous system. A lack of iodine leads to hypothyroidism, fatigue, weight gain, depression, hair loss, and that sluggish running on low battery feeling. Severe deficiency can cause goiter, which is enlargement of the thyroid gland, and in children, developmental delays. In short, iodine keeps your internal engine running at the proper speed. Now, the problem with iodine deficiency is this. Historically, iodine deficiency was widespread in inland populations far from the sea. That's why governments began iodizing salt, table salt, in the 20th century. But here's the twist. People eating processed food actually get less iodine now since most commercial salts used in packaged foods are not iodized. Many have also swapped table salt for gourmet salts, like sea salt or Himalayan salt, which typically don't provide meaningful iodine. Plant-based eaters are especially at risk because plants don't reliably contain iodine unless grown in iodine-rich soil, which is rare. This makes animal foods, especially those from the ocean, a much more reliable source. So the best sources of iodine on a carnivore diet, if you're eating the proper human diet, here's where you'll find iodine. Seafood. Fish like cod, tuna, sardines contain solid amounts. Shellfish like shrimp, oysters, clams, lobster, excellent sources of iodine. Seaweed. Technically not animal-based, but it is one of the richest sources. On carnivore, most people skip it, but it's worth noting. Egg yolks. Hens raised with access to iodine-rich feed provides yolks with meaningful amounts. Dairy. Particularly cheese and milk, but the iodine content depends on the animal's diet and the farming practices. And organ meats. Not as concentrated as seafood, but they do contribute. The ocean remains the best source. Humans evolved near the coasts, and seafood has always been a cornerstone of iodine intake. So, how much iodine do we need? The general recommendations are adults 150 micrograms per day, pregnant women about 220 to 250 micrograms a day, since iodine is crucial for fetal brain development, and breastfeeding women about 290 micrograms a day to support infant growth. A single serving of cod or shrimp can easily cover your daily requirement. Even two eggs can provide around 25 to 30 micrograms and dairy adds more. Those who include seafood once or twice a week rarely have iodine issues. Now, iodine's partners in body chemistry, let's talk about that. Like other minerals, iodine doesn't work alone. Selenium, essential for converting T4 into T3, the active part. Without selenium, iodine metabolism is impaired. Luckily, selenium is abundant in animal-rich foods like beef, lamb, fish, and eggs. Iron, required for thyroid peroxidase, the enzyme that incorporates iodine into thyroid hormone. Deficiency in iron can impair thyroid function even if iodine is sufficient. And zinc, plays a supportive role in thyroid hormone regulation and receptor sensitivity. This is why balance in the diet matters. The carnivore diet naturally delivers this synergy. Iodine, selenium, iron, and zinc all working together to keep the thyroid humming. So what are the signs of iodine deficiency? Even mild deficiency can create issues. 
fatigue and low energy, unexplained weight gain, dry skin and hair loss, cold intolerance, brain fog or slower thinking, and large thyroid goiter in more severe cases. On a proper human diet with seafoods, eggs, and dairy, deficiency is uncommon. But in someone who eats only muscle meat and excludes dairy and seafood, it's worth being mindful. The bottom line, iodine is essential for thyroid health, metabolism, energy, and brain development. It is not something the body can manufacture. We must get it from our food. The proper human diet provides iodine in the most reliable, bioavailable way through seafood, shellfish, eggs, dairy, and organ meats. The modern world tries to patch deficiency with iodized salt, but nature already had the solution built in. By eating the foods humans were meant to eat, you'll cover your iodine needs without supplements or additives. Once again, animal foods prove themselves to be the foundation of human nutrition. Click the thumbs up if you found this helpful and you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already doing that. Share this video with friends and family by clicking that share button and leave me a question or a comment and I will write back to each and every one of you. Thank you so much. Stay tuned for another addition to the mini series on minerals tomorrow. Have a good day.